Hello and welcome to Soda Tasting, an online show dedicated to soda reviews and appreciation. I'm Patrick O'Keefe, and I'm joined on this episode by my brother, Sean. Hi. Welcome back. Thanks. It's been great so far. <laughs> Sean is a member of FBI Improv, uh, youtube.com slash FBI Improv, and we release videos together as Patrick and Sean at patrickandsean.com. So it is New Year's Eve, the last episode of Soda Tasting of 2012. Yep. So no matter how you celebrate tonight, be safe out there. If you drink soda, then obviously you're not uh, intoxicated. But no matter what you enjoy, um, have a good, safe, fun time. And we'll see you tomorrow in 2013. So how are we going to wrap up 2012? We're going to do it with Fentiman's Curiosity Cola. Now this is from Fentiman's, the UK-based botanical brewery. Fentiman's was established in 1905, and Curiosity Cola is a fermented botanical cola drink with ginger and herbal extracts. But this bottle, it's uh, you know, it's pretty cool. Yeah, yeah, pretty unusual. Yeah, and uh, because it is unusual, or different for us anyway, we're used to 12 ounces in our glass bottles here in the U.S. This one is 9.3, but the numbers that I quote you will be based on 12 ounces, just so we have kind of an even standard across the board. So you will have 168 calories, you will have 69 milligrams of caffeine, and it is sweetened with cane sugar. The ingredients are uh, water, carbonated water, Cane sugar, fermented ginger root extracts, which is ginger root, water, and yeast. Cola flavor, flavors, ginger, speedwell, juniper, and yellow extracts. Caramel color, phosphoric acid, and caffeine. Uh, I have to say a special thank you to Samantha James at Phantom is North America for sending me the information about the caffeine content because it's not on the bottle, it's not on the website. So after um, a couple email conversations, I was able to get that information. So thank you very much. And, um, yeah, I recently reviewed Cherry Tree Cola, and uh, it was pretty good. I liked it, and I'm interested to see how, uh, how Curiosity Cola tastes. For those curious, I bought this at Cost Plus World Market. You get it, Curiosity Cola. For those that were curious about Curiosity Cola. <laughs> Funny, I didn't pick that uh, one up. Yeah, let me see. All right. Okay. We're hoping this is better than the last two we uh, taste, tasted. Um... Yeah. Compared to those two, this should just be, like, amazing. This should be, like, uh, our dreams have come true. So, we'll see. All right. Here we go. Oh, let me smell it first, obviously. Yeah, I get the ginger, I think. <sighs> yeah, it smells like it's going to be a tangier cola. You know, there's different kind of colas out there. Tangy colas, spicy colas, sweet colas. There's a mix of those. And I think, I'm, I'm from the smell, it's almost like I expected it to be kind of sweet and kind of tangy. Yeah. That's the smell I'm getting. You get all those, you know, all that, I guess I'm smelling the ginger. And, and the flavors. And other things. Yeah, the flavors. I'm smelling the flavors. Um, I, I don't know why I'm thinking moxie on this one. I hope not. I really hope not. Well, let's see. That's pretty good. Well, upon first taste, that's pretty good. Yeah, I mean... This is one of those colors where you get a lot of mix of different notes of things, and you could that's the flavors, right? I've read yeah. off all those things. Ginger, um, yeast, speedwell, I don't even, <laughs> juniper, yarrow extract. Um, you know, there's all these different, and then there's cola flavors on top of that. Um, the cola flavor, I should say. There's a lot of different things in here, and I think that comes across, and it definitely has that kind of, um, you know, that, that what I call a tea co co cola, that tea quality. It's that herbal quality to a cola. Uh, similar to, um, gosh, the chai cola from Natural Brew. Yeah, that's, you know what, that's what I, you know, that tastes almost exactly like that. Yeah, I've had that now before, so. There's perks to being the brother of the soda taste. Yeah, 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 I had chai cola in my dorm room. When I really buy good. bottles of stuff, I usually, you know, I only use one bottle for tasting. Yeah. And then I'll give a bottle to Sean. It. I mean, I like it. The reason I like it is because even though with all this stuff in there, it's not completely overpowering. It's not... Um, it's pretty smooth. It's pretty smooth, yeah. And there's no... I hate to go back to this. There's no aftertaste after the fact. So, I mean, it finishes well, too. Yeah. Yeah, you know, I do find it smoother than, um, like, Virgil's Real Cola. Or, gosh, what's another one? I did like Virgil's, though. That was really good. You did? That was one. Of, I With think that. Cola? I think that was really my. Fa yeah, that was really good. I liked it a lot. I thought it was even better than maybe Coke, Coca Cola. I don't know. It was, it was good. It was maybe not that far, but yeah. Yeah, it's got an interesting spice to but, it. Um, this one tastes on the border, maybe chai cola, maybe even better. 
So um, if you had to give it a rating, what would you give it? Uh, what did you give the Chai-Cola? I forget. Yeah, that's cool. Um, I would probably say this is in the middle. I, I don't think I would drink this every day, but I wouldn't mind having it again. So maybe, for me, a three... I think a 3 or a 3.5. I'm leaning toward one of those. I mean, 3.5 might be a little too much, so I, I think I'm comfortable with 3. Yeah, it's funny you say that because, and I should really write stuff down before I ask you, but what I was thinking, yeah. I'm kind of in between 2.5 and 3. Right? Okay. Yeah. And, um, you know, I want to say that I like it better than some colas I've given a 2.5 to. Yeah. I like it better than Hanson's Original Cola. I like it better than Virgil's Real Cola. <sighs> So I think I'm going to lean on the three side and go ahead and give it a three out of five. So we match identically on cool. that. Cool. All right. Excellent. Good and job, Fentiments. <laughs> Fentiments, good job. So uh, if you have had any of the Fentiments products, I'd love to hear from you in the comments. You know, they make a, a range of sodas. I've only had two. So I'd love to hear about if you've had these, awesome, or this one, awesome. If you've had others, that's great as well. Please let me know in the comments on YouTube or on Soda Tasting. And uh, please subscribe to receive every show automatically at SodaTasting.com. Sean? Good to have you on again. Good good to be back. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. And uh, as always, everything in moderation. Thank you for watching.